All right, y'all, got a topic for y'all today. Playing hard to get versus disinterest. What's the difference between somebody playing hard to get and them just straight up not being interested in you? That is a good question. It's actually kind of a harder question to ask than most people would think because I posted this status as a joke on uh, Twitter. I was like, people still playing hard to get in 2020 and they wonder why they can't find anybody? SMH. But, uh, yeah, but that's the funny thing about it. It's because, and the thing is, I see this all the time on Facebook or whatever. It's the same dude whose name I'm not going to say who keep on commenting on another chick's pictures and statuses, always hearting her status and everything, who's also whose name I'm not going to say, and he always asks, when am I going to take you out, when, when can I see you, when are you going to let me take you out on a date, and the response is always the same, she either says, we'll see or I'll let you know, and then I'm like, damn dude, you've been doing this back and forth for a long time now, um, are you sure you don't want to give up, and then, she's, and then he's like, nah man, she's just playing hard to get, uh, she'll come around eventually, nigga, it's been two and a half years, if she hasn't come around yet, then guess what, she's not going to come around ever, give it up. And then you have some women who will just be straight up with it. Well, I'm not playing hard again. I just don't like you. And the thing is, those are the ones who I actually respect a lot more. But, you know, you got the guys who will be straight up and tell a woman that they're disinterested too. They won't really play hard to get. I mean, this could, I get, this could apply to either gender or whatever. But how do you tell the difference? Um, one of the main differences is their communication with you. Um, are you always contacting them first? Are you getting dry responses? Do you get very little interaction? Do you always get an excuse? Is it always something like, well, is it always like a half-assed or half-hearted response that they get from you? Because that's the difference where you can tell if somebody is genuinely disinterested in you. Like, you know, the thing is, y'all got to pick up on that. Because guess what? If they're truly interested in you, they'll call you. They'll text you, and they won't have a problem with it. And the thing is, do y'all want to know what the number one thing is? Is if they give you the same energy that they don't give anybody else. But yeah, that's the key difference is if if they are giving you a different vibe or different energy that they are not giving other people, that is genuine interest. Now, don't get me wrong, because a lot of them, they still, even if they might be interested in you, they don't want to make it completely and totally easy for you because they don't want to make it seem like they're easy. They might flirt around with you a little bit. They might try to make it seem, they might try to make it a little bit difficult for you. They might try to see, they, they might try to push your buttons because if they got a lot of options, they are going to play hard to get. And the thing is, they will. They, they, they might let you, they might let their options be known to you. It's like, well, I do like you, but I do got other options. So I'm just going to see what I can get away with or I'm going to see like, how far I can push you before you show interest in me or before you just, you know, just straight up just walk out the door. Because a lot of dudes and some females, like, they will just tell you straight up. It's like, well... If I get the interest, if I get the sense that you're either disinterested in me altogether, or if I sense you're playing hard to get, then I'm gonna just walk out all altogether. Don't waste my time. And you can't really count on some people to be as direct as others because guess what? If I'm interested in you, you'll know it. If I'm not interested in you, you'll know it. And some people will give you the exact same vibe and the exact same energy. If you, if they don't like you, whether they like you or not, you will know it. And some people do see playing hard to get as a game or as a test, and it is. It really is. I mean, it's just a test to see how long you'll stick around. It's like the, uh, it's like, it's kind of like a job interview. It's kind of like process of elimination. It's like, well, out of all the people who are trying to get to know me and trying to get, you know, be, show interest in me, why should I pick you over them? And that, that pretty much is a good question. That's when you see, like, the true test is when you, you the thing is, the key thing to getting to know somebody is you got to stand out. What makes you different from the 5, 10, 15, 20 other people who are trying to get the opportunity to get to know that person? And that's pretty much what, what sets you apart from them. And bottom line, some people, they like to chase. It's like, okay, I see you playing hard to get. All right, I'll play along for a little bit, but I'm not going to play this cat and mouse game with you forever. It's like, are we doing this or are we not doing this? But some people, they'll get right to the point. They'll be like, hey, is we doing this or nah? Are you gonna are you gonna give me the run around like you give everybody else to run around, or are we just gonna be 100% direct with this? And that's something that I do really respect. I respect somebody just nipping it in the bud, or just you know telling me what exactly what they want, their intentions are, than for me have to chase them around for five, six, seven, eight months, or whatever, or however long, only for them to tell me that they're not interested, or only for them just to cut me off for someone else. Because guess what? I have had that happen. I had it happen several times where. I was, you know, given I was given the runaround for months on end, only for them to, to be not interested. And it's like, damn, you wasted my time and you wasted your time. But uh, yeah, you guys, let me know what are your experiences of this? What's the difference between somebody playing hard to get and them not being? Interested?